Stuart, a great 2 1 win this evening against Dundran and Swiss. What were your thoughts on the game? I thought we were outstanding. I thought for the first 30 minutes, I thought we were really, really good. I thought we could have been 4 or 5 up, and then we switched off. And to be fair, the last 10 15 minutes of the first half, then we were, we were under a caution wee bit and we had to see it out. But I went in at half time and I had a chat and I told them to be confident because I generally thought our overall play for the majority of the first half was outstanding. And um, they delivered the second half. I was just looking at our time and when we were going to score. I thought it wasn't coming. But their goalkeeper's man of the match. And I didn't think they got out of their half, second half. So listen, I'm really, really happy with that. Really, really good performance at home. And it's a great result for us. As you say, we started really well, you know, created a lot of chances. Obviously, Curtis Versace does really well for the first goal, but we just could have maybe got another one or two, which could have changed the game. Yeah, listen, I gave my centre forward to the praise the last week or two, and they fully deserve it. And again, I thought they were all good, didn't But we were a bit wasteful, especially the first half hour. Um, wrong choices, etc. But they created the chances, and I'd be more worried if we weren't creating chances. So, listen, if we play like that at home, we're a hell of an outfit. So, yeah, listen, we, we could have been a couple up and then we got hit with a sucker punch and we don't defend very well. And um, listen, the reaction I got was brilliant. Well, I suppose that's what happens when you don't take your chances. You know, you always want to leave yourself open at the other end and you know, Dundran and capitalise on, on a mistake from us to, to equalise. Yeah, it was their first shot, I think. It's their first shot. And it's sort of been a, a wee bit of a theme the last couple of games where we've given them way bad goals. but. Thankfully now I've got players who can affect the game on the other side of the pitch. And um listen, we look we looks big and strong and um summer play tonight was outstanding. And listen, it's promising, that's all I can say. Certain half then, you know, with it being level, it was very end to end, you know, both teams had chances and it always looked like there maybe was going to be a late goal and it was very brave from, from Kyle Terry, you know, getting the penalty and then Kush obviously blasting it in. Yeah. <laughs> I would have been not happy if we hadn't like won tonight. No, on the other side, like, you, you get beat tonight and you're going home really, really disappointed. But um, yeah, Kai was brave. And listen, I brought him to the club a couple of years ago. I think he's been phenomenal. I think he scored a lot of goals. And he's a leader. And there's no other man that I want to take at. And um, listen, he's buried it. And we've got three points out of it. So far, you know, it's been a bit of a up and down, you know, season so far. Only six games in, but a bit of a roller coaster, I suppose. You know, you just want to get a wee bit more consistency going forward and, and more results and performances like tonight. Yeah, well, I'm quite happy with our. Obviously, we've had a few bad results, but overall, I'm quite happy. I think some of our performances um, have been very, very good against some of the bigger teams, and then tonight we've branded one out. So, listen, it, we always want to do better. We've all got to stay grounded, but. It's promising, and that's all I can say. I just really want us to knock it down and be really hard to beat. And the, the, the togetherness tonight was outstanding. It was really evident to see. We'll take a break from league action on Tuesday night when we welcome Cliftonville in the 20 Under Shield. What are your thoughts going into that one? I have to see who's available because a lot of them are carrying knocks. Um, some boys need minutes. But listen, it's a game where we can go and attack. They've done us big style at their place. So let's see if we can. Reverse that, and um, we're not going to sit back and, and, and be cannon fodder. We want to go and attack them exactly what we've just done tonight. Well done, Stuart, and thank you. Thank you so much.